Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Yes! Perfect! Meant to do that! Landed it! Yeah, bitches! Oh shit! I'm supposed to hit the flag? God damn it! What's going on everybody, Dre Guest here, and today we're playing another bridge simulator. This one's called Bridge Constructor Stunts, but this one focuses more on Obviously, the stunt aspect of these bridge simulators that have been coming out as of late. Uh, looks very much like Polybridge, except you can actually control the vehicle. So it might be fun. I actually played through the tutorial here. Um, it basically, it kind of held your hand as you were doing the level, so I wasn't going to showcase that. Uh, but yeah, I know how to play now, so that's good. We are on the second world. I've played already through the first level. But we're going to play it again just so you guys can see it. Now, as you can see, like this is the first thing I saw when I uh, heard about this game. It looks a lot like Polybridge. It's not, it's not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, I'm just hoping it's not like very clone-like, if you will. But yes, this is the map that we have to successfully go across, and we have $30,000 to build whatever we want. As you can see, you can go all the way to the end here. Uh, and basically, this is already set up. I already built what we needed to do, so we'll just go quickly through this. Now, you can actually control this car. For example, I can do a backflip here if I want to, which is probably a very stupid idea because it's going to slow us down too much. And we're going to land on the roof and break that bridge. Okay, I'm actually stuck on my bridge, so that was a very stupid idea. Let's try it again here, though, and actually not try and show off and do a backflip right at the start, because that would be a very stupid idea. All right, nice landing so we don't break this. That's, well, that that broke it, but who the hell cares? I love how there's, like, added explosions and everything in this game, too. But yeah, there you go. Very similar to something like Polybridge, except you can control it more. So actually, it's a lot more fun, to be totally honest. Some levels contain red construction ban areas. You cannot place any joints there, and elements cannot pass through them. Okay, now add the existing ramps, overcome the construction site, yada yada yada. Build shit to beat this level, essentially. Oh, you know what? Actually, it's still holding my hand. So this is the way that kind of the tutorial went. They half built things for you, and you just gotta build the other half. Uh, it works, again, a lot like Polybridge, though. So we're gonna do something like that. And then, oh, I can't actually attach it to that? That's lame. Okay, let's just go for something nice and low like this. That should be totally fine. And then we will attach that to this. I'm going to assume it's going to need more support than that. So we will do a nice little triangle beam right here. So that's good. It looks good there. Let's go around here. Uh, we're going to jump up there, crash through this thing. Hopefully land here. Everything looks fine here. I think this is just reinforcement. All right, this looks good. First try. Let's see how we do, though. I'm going to assume this might take a couple of tries here. I don't want to go too fast. Oh, God, don't break on me yet. Okay, and through we go. Yes, this is working great, but I'm definitely going to need to build a bridge here. I'm realizing that right now. So back to the nice music where we get to build things. Now, I actually can't build a bridge here because, as you can see, there is the dreaded red zone. Uh, which is the zone that we cannot build in. So I'm just going to build kind of the best ramp that I currently can. We did slow down a lot, so I'm going to do a nice high ramp, something like that right now. We'll see how that works. Uh, let's put that there, and then we'll do a nice little T-beam as well. I, lo I, I love the reach you have in this game. Maybe I'm used to Polybridge, but usually you cannot make this much road in one click. And a nice little triangle beam over here. Let's try it out again here and see how good we do. The starting wasn't too bad. I mean, everything went pretty well here, aside from that thing breaking. But this really slows me down, as you can see. Now, the problem is the shit gets in my way as well. Okay, I did another run and there's nothing in my way. So let's hope we can get up enough speed to get over that fucking edge now. <laughs> Okay, well, I think we went a little too high on that jump there. Let's do something more realistic like that and try it again. Oh god, oh god, don't, don't bring me down with you. Don't do it, don't do it. I'm not gonna fall. No, Simba. Okay, that's much better. Let's keep the speed of going here. Oh yeah, we definitely made it this time. Okay, well, this is good to know. It's not so much focused on the bridge building and more focused on, you know, using the vehicle to your advantage, you know, hitting the brakes and whatnot. Things that you can't actually do in Polybridge. Polybridge, you just gotta build the best ramp you can and hope for the best. This game's more kind of like Trials Evolution meets Polybridge, which is an... I, I like it. It's a nice, different feeling game. Pay attention to the requirements for each level. Green stars are generally optional, but in this level, you have to collect the green star to complete the level. Good to know. Okay, so I'm, I'm, I'm liking that they're putting goals as well. The takeoff ramp is too flat. Adjust it to get to the star. Okay. 
Why would you build me a takeoff ramp that doesn't even work then? That, that That's that's my bigger question. All right, we're going to want to go pretty hardcore here. We do have something on top of me as well, so i got to pay attention to that. But we're going to go something like that. Yeah, there we go. And I'm thinking that star territory right there. we got lots of money to spend, so I am going to spend it. Okay, this is definitely the biggest ramp I've ever built, though, so I'm actually worried about the physics of it. All right, let's move this a little bit. I feel like it would be a little better there. Uh, the bridge building is actually really well done in this game as well. Very similar to Polybridge. Nice and easy feel feeling. I'm going to obviously do a lot of comparisons from this to Polybridge only because they are so similar. Okay, I actually went over budget, so you know what? Let's just get rid of that see what happens here. You can actually have a physics button to see if your thing's okay. Uh, uh, well, that's not good. That's a little red, but... Uh, I guess we'll try it for right now. Is there anything else I need to do here? We gotta jump on that. I'm assuming we'll land up here, or maybe all the way down there. Who the hell knows? There's a little nut there. I'm assuming we gotta get that as well, but the ending is right here. So I gotta assume you don't wanna land up here. You gotta somehow land down there. That's gonna be a hard jump to do. Okay, let's save a little bit of money here. We're just gonna go something like that, I think. And I'm also going to even this out a little bit. Uh, I think I just turned that into road. I don't want that road. There we go. All right, let's try this thing out. This is a really ugly looking big ass ramp, but please just stabilize me. Oh, I'm going way too far. This is not where I wanna be in explosions. Okay, so the good thing about this game is we can either fix the jump or just slow down the car. I'm actually going to make this a little smaller here since we can. I I, I want to go at it full throttle. You know what? Let's just get rid of this and see what happens. We'll go make this nice and straight as well and connect this to this and this to this. I don't, I don't know why my voice just went like that. There we go. That should be good. And let's try it again here. Okay, last time it was too far. Let's see if this jump is good enough. There we go. We hit it and we hit the wall and yeah, that's not good. We're on fire. Oh, we just fucking exploded. That's even better. And we fell off the map as well. God, that, that guy is not having a good day. Oh, oh, come on, grab that shit. Oh, man, and that was the perfect landing. Okay, well, we didn't finish the level. We have to collect that star, uh, but we're, we are getting slightly closer. That's it. That's it. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling good. I feel good about it. Yes, and I got the nut as well. Okay, so I successfully got everything on that one. Total 9,022. Come at me, bros. I have no idea if that's a good score or not, by the way. Okay, so next level, we actually get steel cables now. This sounds very familiar. Uh, it's all obviously still doing a little bit of a tutorial as well. Oh, I'm supposed to actually click it. Uh, but yes, we've seen these in Polybridge before, and now they're in this game as well. So that's going to hold up that whole thing. We don't even need any sort of support. That's amazing, because usually in Polybridge, this starts flapping about like crazy. Let's actually simulate it and just make sure. Yeah, that's totally fine. Cool. Okay, I wonder if that's all we had to do. All, all the rest of the stuff is built for me, so let's just try this. I don't know if I like that. I mean, I understand we're still early into the game, and it's trying to hold your hand, essentially, but I just want to build my own shit, man. I, I want to be unique. Uh, we should probably try and go for that. Let's try that again. We're going to rebuild and get that damn thing. I want to get this green star. Okay, well, obviously, all we need to do is go a little higher, something like that, and let's try it out again. Oh, yeah, there we go. This is going to be a hard hit, but yes, there we go. Come on, land it. Oh, shit. Well, we went over the nut. I didn't even notice that before, but screw the nut. We got the star. That's what's most important. Okay, this is looking like... What the fuck? How do you get down there? Oh, man, this is this is, this is is getting interesting. Can you start down here? Like, how is this even possible? Uh, all right, I'm just not going to question it. Well, we have a red zone here, so we obviously need to build some sort of jump up here. And I don't know what. There's a lot of red zones. I, I, I don't like the added rules. Well, let's just start off with a simple little jump here. We will increase it to something like that. That feels good. Uh, what I also really like about this game is you can change your materials on the fly. You can see that I made this actually out of support beams, but just a simple click turns them into roads. So it makes it very simple to do this. Okay, so that's our first jump. That will land us somewhere over here, I'm assuming. And then we got to build some sort of other jump here. So let's start doing that right now. That looks good. Something like that. And can I put this on the ground, I wonder? No, that doesn't even allow me to do that. Okay. I also just noticed this is actually a platform up here where to get to the star, so you know what? I'm going to increase this so we can get some major air here. And then before we even try this, I feel like I gotta slowly fall down this or I'm gonna break my car, so we'll do something like that. Let's just attach this to this. Actually, I wonder if I can 
do that. Oh, yeah, perfect. So I can turn that into road and then leave that other piece as uh, support. And we'll just do something like that. Okay, if this works first try, I'll be amazed because I'm usually not that good first try. So here we go. Let's try her out here and see what happens. First jump. Uh, looks pretty damn stable. Oh, perfect. Yes, slow down, slow down, slow down. Nice and slow. And landed it. And give her. Come on, please. Aw, oh, shit. You know what? I'm getting cocky. I could do a simple fix to successfully do this level, but I want to go get this star as well. I I'm being very aggressive here considering we kind of had a rocky start, but uh, I think this should be okay. Let's do another support here since we do have 35,000 freaking dollars to do this one. They're giving me way too much money right now. All right, try number two. The first jump was like perfect. It just lands perfectly up there. Oh, never mind. I lied. And... They're falling down. Oh, God. This is not working as planned now. Come on, please make it. Ah, oh, shit. So as I was saying about that perfect first jump, there we go. Now I can maybe land this. Oh, that was a really hard landing, unfortunately. And as you can see, not even close to getting that thing. Okay, doing some changes, trying to make this a little bit more stable over here. I added some more road to make it not so rocky, because the less road you have, obviously, the more angles you have. And cars don't generally like hard angles. Why did this turn into that? There we go. Something like that should be good. And obviously, we got to turn all this as well. So yeah, I just added a lot more road. Therefore, it's a little bit more, you know, smooth, if you will. The one problem being I don't actually have a connection point over here, though. So I wonder if I just falls onto the ramp as we will quickly find out right now yeah ooh ooh no that's not good that's not good at all god damn it it's falling over and also this thing i i, I guess putting cables attached to this is not a good idea because it doesn't like that either so i wonder if i just do something oh god damn it are you serious okay well let's try something else to grab this then something like that should be a oh oh yeah that's a red zone god damn it all right, here we go. We did a few changes, and we will see how it's working right now. Actually, I really wanted to do that so I can slow down here. And bam. Oh, we're not even going to get close, are we? Jesus Christ. All right, you know what? Screw that star. Well, we might go for the stars later on, but honestly, I can easily finish this if I just get rid of this. So I think we're going to do that. Okay, so now we just need a road that crosses this. Now, we do have some support points over here, which we probably can use. Again, I still have no idea how you're supposed to go down here. I'm assuming you're supposed to back up or something and do something crazy. I'm not into that. We're just going to do a straight road all the way across here, uh, and I'm going to hopefully support it off of this one little support beam that I can use. Okay, first jump. You guys have seen this one enough. You know how well it works. Works perfectly. And slow down, slow down. No, I don't want to miss it. All right, let me just see if this thing works. Oh, yeah, no problem at all. All right, we're going to retry that and make sure I get at least that one star. And it uh, looks like we successfully completed this one. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Yes! Perfect! Meant to do that. Landed it. Yeah, bitches! Oh, shit! I'm supposed to hit the flag? God damn it. Okay, let's not get cocky. We're going we're gonna to do the same thing here. Look at that. Except this time... Slow down a bit, you know? Just just, just take it easy. That way we, you know, can actually hit the flag there. Perfect. Okay, and the final level on World 2. I'm going through this game really quickly. There's actually only six worlds, so I'm worried that this game's a little bit short. But we got a new vehicle, a dump truck. As the dump truck is much heavier than the tow truck, the existing ramp won't be able to hold it. You need to reinforce the ramp. Okay, it looks like we got steel beams now. Again, things we've seen in Polybridge before. I'm sure you guys, if you follow my Polybridge series know a lot about this game already. It's just pretty much exactly the same. Okay, but this looks like a pretty basic level. We start here to land on this thing. We have to go through these boxes and we got to build some sort of jump here to jump over the structure onto this other ramp here. So we just got to build one little ramp here and we should be good to go. Let's uh, definitely use the steel beams considering they gave them to us this time. So they probably want us to use them. Actually, I want to use road first, obviously, to make the road and then we'll use steel beams. Okay, let's just try something crazy like that. That's going to be a really high jump. And can we actually make metal road? Wait, let, let me just check that out first to make sure. Is this just steel beams, or can I actually make metal road with this? Oh, you can? Okay, so there's new road as well, and I'm assuming this road is more stable. So that's actually really cool. You can have metal road and wooden road. So because we are using the dump truck, obviously we want some metal road here. And there we go, and then we just reinforce this like we have done a million times before. And we should do just fine. Okay, let's just... Oh, oh, that's not good. That broke freaking metal. Are you serious? Okay, what if I do... 
something like, well, I don't know if this is really gonna help too much. Okay, I'm just probably wasting money here, but I'm just gonna try something like that and see what happens. Oh, oh, still, yeah, it's still breaking it, so that didn't help at all. You know what, let's just keep it simple here. We're just gonna try, you know what, move this in. I, I was just building, I think, too big of a ramp, and it doesn't need that big of a ramp. Okay, it's a bit bendy, but uh, metal's made to bend, I guess? Not really, but uh, I, I, I'm, I'm just gonna say that to feel better about myself here. Anyways, let's try out the dump truck. Oh, shit! Oh my god! The bridge was deteriorating behind me, and I've lost my wheels? That is so cool. You know, I went into this thinking, I don't know about this game, it feels just like a Polybridge clone, but honestly, I'm learning really quickly, this is a really cool game here. Even like the weight in the back is shifted as you move, so every time I do this, it's a different run. The first time it worked perfectly, I haven't changed shit, and now I can't seem to get it right, god damn it! So the issue I see with this is, firstly, we need to go a little bit higher here, secondly, uh, we should probably change some of this to metal. But I'm actually just gonna try this for right now. We do have quite a bit of money to spend if I need to, but I feel like all I need is that little bit of jump. And I might be okay, assuming I can stabilize this. There we go, that's what I wanted. And come on, jump over. Oh my god, thank you for the explosion. I needed that. And landed, and we did it. Oh my god, that felt so great. Okay, guys, well, that was World 2. I'm kind of bummed we're already, you know, in the middle of the game, if you will, uh, because I am really enjoying this one. But obviously, let me know what you guys think in the comments below. Do you like this one? Is it uh, something you would like to see more of? I think I wouldn't mind doing a couple more episodes, but ultimately, it's up to you guys if you guys want to see more or not. So, as always, guys, thanks for all your support. Let me know in the comments below what you think of this, and I'll see you in the next one.